Are you ready? I am. I've got my mask. I've got my gloves. And I've got my spam. I'm ready. Because here's the deal. It's coming. And we better be ready. In fact, I was out and about today and people are getting ready. They're stocking up. In fact, all the spam was almost gone. People are getting ready. Yeah, when we talk about getting ready, what exactly are we getting ready for? Have you thought about it? Because it is coming. But it may not be the thing that you think. See, we're in the middle of a pandemic right now. And people are freaking out, thinking that it's coming. And the truth is, it is coming, but it's not what it is that we're freaking out about. See, there is something that is out there that could potentially come. There's a possibility. There's a chance. But even if this thing does come, if this pandemic does happen, the statistics tell us that 97% of all people will be just fine. But there's something that is coming that we need to prepare for where every single one of us is gonna have to deal with it. And so are you ready? Well, what is that thing that's coming? Well, it's not a virus, it's the return of Jesus. See, we've been studying recently in 1 Peter that there will be a day when Christ returns, that we need to be ready for it, that we need to be prepared for it, that we need to be living lives that speak his name right now, that the deeds that we do are so good that people look at us and they praise him on the day that he returns. God will visit us once again. Jesus will return. Are you ready? Well, there's one way to be ready, and that's to be prepared. To believe in Jesus Christ as your personal Lord and Savior, because there is a day that's coming, and it's been delayed, and we've been waiting, and there's still a promise for it. And yet the thing is that 100% of every individual, every single person that's ever walked the face of this earth, will stand before Christ someday to account for what it is that they've done. And so in this life, we must be prepared. We must live great lives. We must love each other. We must care for those around us. We must be examples of who Jesus is. So when he returns, people will glorify him because of us. So don't go out and buy all the things that you think you need to be prepared for something you may not experience. Rather, go out and find the thing that you need to be prepared for the day that will come. And that thing that you need is Jesus. So are you prepared? Are you ready?